change the fuel filter, you need a 17 millimeter uh, line and then a millimeter socket. And then with the socket, um, sometimes I needed a, just a little one to get with it off, and sometimes I needed the whole full extension, and sometimes I needed both of them together. Um, and then the fuel filter itself is with a three quarter inch. You don't really need it except to hold it in place. And then there's these two little screws that go on the top and on the bottom. You can see there, I put the one on the top. Um, and then on the side, which you gotta be careful of, is that the holes in the screws are pointing the right way. They're pointing up. There's a hole that goes through it and the fuel has to go through it, so you gotta line it up. It's kinda hard. But um yeah, so these are 12 millimeter top and bottom, and then the sides are 17 millimeter. It's easiest to get it from the side, but you can also go. Sometimes I had to reach in here and get it. You can see it there as well. And then um, hopefully you can see here what I was talking about on the sides. I'm trying to count it up. Yeah, you can see there how it's. There we go. How that has to go sideways. See how there's a line that I drew on it that goes in the hole. And it helps also to place the, the arrow on the fuel filter place facing the back of the truck and try to line it up with the middle of the holder on it. Um, that is the easiest. It's pretty much you uh, unscrew the the uh, sides first, and then you unmount the filter with the bracket and everything. Put the new one in. Uh, aim the arrow to point the back in the middle, and there you have it. It's a '99 Tacoma 2.4 manual.